did the death roll again. I nearly shat in my pants. I nearly, nearly had a heart attack. What's up guys? Welcome to a new video. Yes, it happened. It happened. The Avatar 2 does do the death roll. But let's start off. After a week of bad weather, I could finally take my new Avatar 2 out to fly. Flying, doing my things, easy flying, some kind of freestyle flying over some trees, doing some cool power loops, doing some dives, you know, just testing how, out how the new Avatar flies compared to the Avatar 1 because I flew the Avatar 1 quite a lot, had lots of death rolls. So I thought, you know what? Let me just test it out. So I did, went full gas, full gas straight, did a sharp right turn and then a little bit of a dive and that's when it happened. It did the death roll. I nearly shat in my pants. Well, let's stop talking. I'll show you the whole flight. So what do you guys think? Is it a DJI mistake again? Or is it just the way the Avatar 2 is built, made up? We mustn't forget it's a Cinewhoop. It's not made, it's not a freestyle, it's not a racing drone. It's a drone made for slow, indoor, outdoor flying, cinematic footage. So that's one thing we mustn't forget, guys. If you guys have any questions, please comment down below. I'm going to be doing a lot more Avatar 2 reviews in the future. Best camera settings, best, cin best cinematic settings. I'm going to review the Goggles 3 because they are actually really awesome. They fit me much better than the Goggles 2. I'm going to be reviewing the Remote Controller 3. I'm even going to this really big waterfall here in the mountains and I'm going to dive, dive it with Avatar 2. So if you guys like content like that, please like this video subscribe for more see you in the next video ciao for now